So I had a pretty emotional morning because it's Thanksgiving and it's one of my first Thanksgivings that I've ever spent away from my family. And so I'm like just feeling a little bit sad, but I'm launching my clothing line today, which is crazy because people don't normally see the inside of like, you know, how people are feeling and stuff. And you just see them doing big things, you know what I mean? And you just don't see the, you know, the process. I'm also making a wig. It is Thanksgiving, yes. Um, making a wig, I have two more to make. Um, I wanna make two today, but I don't know, I might go grab some food. And then later on, I think I'm gonna go live, you know, to kind of pump up the launch of my clothing line, because I haven't really talked about it on my YouTube, um, you know, because I just wanna make sure everything's right first. I don't know how my day is gonna go. My brain is really flustered, because I have a lot, so much stuff going on right now trying to check the laptop to make sure my developer is getting everything done on time and that everything looks right. I'm literally going behind him. Like I feel like a I feel like a um, like a babysitter because he's doing what he's supposed to do, but like I think cuz he's in such a, a rush and a panic as well because it's a time difference. Um, he's like missing some things and messing some things up. So instead of me complaining to him about it and throwing him off of the list of things I told him to do, I'm literally just going behind him, watching him do stuff and then like fixing it. So I'll sew two rows down and I'll go down and sit, I'll go and sit down and start seeing what he's doing. So that's just why I haven't really been picking up my camera, you guys. I'm just doing a lot. It's really stressful and it's hard to like grab the camera when you're like going doing all this type of stuff. You know what I mean? I'm just trying to stay on track. I hope you guys understand. I'm still trying. I'm gonna keep the camera close. So if anything changes, like I haven't eaten today, all I've had is this much water. That much. This is the supernova hair that I'm. I'm actually making um, a supernova wig right now, and then this is the one I washed this morning. And it's not been hot outside. It's pretty cold outside, but it's drying. So I just finished this wig. I'm about to go take a shower. So we're not eating until like six. Okay. So I'm gonna take a shower and like do my makeup and hair. And then um, I might just pull up to Chris' house to get some food and then come back. The way I installed this, I put the shortest length at the bottom and then I put the two longer lengths at the top. So it's like really full at the bottom. <laughs> I'm loving the look. How long does it take to carve the turkey? Mm. Maybe you should be like peeping in or be like, hey, just say, come down when it's ready so that way we can know. Something, you know? Communicate so that way they don't think that they're waiting for us again. Mama, don't worry. Chris, mom got me. <laughs> My mom was like, Where are you gonna go? <laughs> For real? <laughs> Your, your mom's out of the country? Yeah. No, she's in LA. Oh, okay. What's this, color green? Is that what you're saying? Never had green. I'm African. We have like July 5th and 7th, you know? I think it's giving us a little different. <laughs> yeah, everyone. So, what is it? Huh? July 5th? It's things, I mean, we don't celebrate Thanksgiving, you know? Mm hmm. But since everybody else is cooking, we cook too. <laughs> But it don't be American food. It be American food. Yeah. Well, this isn't really American. It's more of black people you call it. Black yeah, that's American. Black people are American. No, they're black. But black American. They're black. It's still called American food. <laughs> You're trying to play me right now. <laughs> I'm just saying, white people eat casserole and big stuff. Oh. <laughs> that's American food too. There's just different types, you know? But that's white. I'm just trying to what was that. I watching that just said that? What? What he just said. What he said. What? Did Bernie Mac say that? Probably. So I just finished live streaming. We're live. Real Rose is live. Hey, you want to go to the mall too? Fuck it. We already took our naps. Energy sucks. I know. That's my what I mean. A successful launch. Hopefully, Mandy doesn't go to sleep. Where's my phone? I'm gonna keep in touch with him. What's up, my big daddies? So 
I launched my clothing line last night and so far the problems are very minimal. I'm not getting a lot of like real big problems or complaints so that's good. I think that was the scariest part for me like what if it crashes what if you know I don't know. There's still the what ifs are still in my head like because we haven't gotten to where we're supposed to be yet but definitely still scared. Anyways, I warmed up my um, leftovers. I'm about to go to Best Buy. I want to get a new camera. And so does Chris, so he's going to meet me there. Here are my leftovers. <laughs> I don't know. Does anybody else just like to mix them all together and just eat it like that? Like, some people are like, don't let my food touch. I'd be like, throw it all in there. Especially for Thanksgiving. For Thanksgiving, I need it all to be in there and all mixed up. <laughs> it's weird. So I'm in Best Buy right now. It's pretty packed. looking at cameras and I was here a couple weeks ago and the prices are the same so I don't know I don't understand I was literally here two weeks ago about to buy a camera and I was like wait Black Friday is coming up so let me wait for that but they're literally the same exact price I'm not sure the sale and I'm not sure which one I want either this is not like a protector. That's the camera you're looking at over there. The first one at the bottom. Right here. Yep. Oh, these cameras are expensive. For so, us. we just left Best Buy. We didn't buy anything because um, the guy said a lot of the cameras and stuff were out of stock. So, we're probably just going to go online and see if we can get them there. Um, right now, um, today is leg day. I ate a good amount of food yesterday. So, we got to go hard. Today. You go hard every day, but even harder today. Cause I ate a lot of food between this time yesterday and this time today. <laughs> yeah, I ate a lot of sweets, so I gotta run that off. Sweets, you said? Yeah, and I don't normally eat sweets like that, but they were just too tempting. Oh my God, his mom's little cake! I don't That's know what, funny. how the hell she made them cakes. Like the crust, she made right. the crust too, or she bought the crust? No, no she. Ate nah, it. she bought the crust. She, she had to buy the crust. That crust was, I've never had a crust like that before in my life. She probably <laughs> did buy the crust. Okay. <laughs> I'm like, nah, nah, nah. Get the possible. Uh, like, maybe, uh, <laughs> but, um, yeah, that's why it's like, that's why I was like, it was, it was tempting growing up trying not to get fat. Well, what do you mean trying not to get fat? Didn't you get fat? Is that not why we're here? <laughs> <laughs> nice. What do you mean? It's okay. I said growing up. Well, I'm saying. You That's got what, fat growing up, and then now we're here, right? Or is that wrong? All right, I went. I went through. I had stages where I was skinny, mm -hmm. gained weight, lost it, gained weight, lost it. Oh, you I'm, on on, I'm, I'm in a. I'm on a. <laughs> he was on I'm on that cycle type shit. Like there's just time. Like then there's that times where I was just huge as shit. And, like I've just had different phases. My body's been through so many different phases. Damn, that's crazy. I was like, I was like two seventeen, and I was. At my, you know what I mean? Like I was big as shit. Mm -mm. So shit you got stretch marks? Yeah. Really? Where? On my arms. Really? Yeah. <laughs> oh, you didn't marks. bring a grinder, did you? Did you buy wheat? Did you buy the blunt? <gasps> no. Gotta go. That's why. I, and you know what? I'm gonna go right here. Good morning, my baby daddy. So, I got my wig in my hand. Makeup is done. I don't know. My lip looks like. I put too much highlight on it. Um, I just did a quick makeup because I'm gonna go meet somebody at Chick-fil-A. He told me he was gonna take me out to eat. And I was like, he said this fancy ass restaurant and I was like, how about lunch at Chick-fil-A? Because I've been craving Chick-fil-A and so that's what I'm about to go get even though I eat Chick-fil-A damn near every fucking other day. So that's what I wanted, so I don't care. You could do that, you could even do that, I don't care. I love it. You could even do that. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. But um, I'm going to charge my portable charger because cause I'm feeling my phone is going to be dead for the gym. So I'm going to do that first and then I'm going to head down. What's up, y'all? So I'm at Best Buy again because we didn't get the camera last time, but I think Chris is going to go ahead and buy it this time. 
Um, I don't know if I'm still gonna buy mine, I'm not sure, but I'm also gonna film um, my Christmas decor video and I wanted to just do the um, shopping now since it's like Sunday and it should be like people dying down because they need to go back to work tomorrow and stuff like that. So I was like, let's go hit up Big Lots, hit up like Staples, hit up Walmart and see what we can get for Christmas. Um, I wanna decor my apartment and I wanna invite people over for Christmas. I think that'll be really cute. So I don't know where the Christmas tree is gonna go, but I'm gonna figure it out because I need a Christmas tree. Hmm. I don't know where I'm gonna put it, but we'll figure it out, like I said. It might just be in the middle of the dining room. Like, <laughs> fuck it. I might push the table to the wall and then put the tree. I don't know, or bring the table out or turn the table sideways and put the tree in the corner. I think that's what I'm gonna do. But we'll see. Christmas McDonald? Yeah. I'm trying to get that pin code number though. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> so yeah, he's gonna get the camera. I'm gonna order mine tomorrow. Um, Cyber Monday. By Ditch has a, a bundle deal. Y'all know I love them bundles. Some of it, I'm not gonna have all of it. What's up, y'all? We at Buy Lots. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's a big lots, but the G is missing. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. Not really. They don't have that much Christmas stuff in here. Today, I wanted to do a Christmas decor video where I'm just going to decorate the hell out of my house because a lot of people don't know, but I'm like obsessed with Christmas. It's my favorite time of the year. For the past couple Christmases, it's been like, you know, kind of, uh, I don't know, you know, I was here and there but now that I'm actually settled and I'm doing my thing I wanted to decorate my apartment it's my apartment so I can decorate it however the fuck I want so we here at Big Lots first we're gonna go around and we're gonna look at some places some things I want to get a Christmas tree I'm not really sure how I'm gonna decorate it right now but I plan on doing it real big <laughs> oh they got Christmas trees over here and they're pretty good prices. I never knew that Christmas trees were that cheap. This one is really nice, I like this. <gasps> it lit up on me. Did it just turn on out of nowhere? Or is it like blinking? <gasps> oh no, that's not, I thought I was doing it. <laughs> I think I wanna do something small though. It's looking like the one right there. I do plan on going to Walmart after this, so I'm gonna probably buy a tree here. If the price is better at Walmart, then I'm gonna take that hole right back because y'all know how it goes. <laughs> it's looking like they don't have the tree that I want, but they got aisles and aisles of Christmas stuff. If you guys didn't think about going to Big Lots, what, what did he say? They're not there, but. Oh, okay. So yeah, they don't have the Christmas tree that I want. So I don't think I'm gonna get anything from here. I told him to check with another store. Okay, thank you. Now we're in Walmart. Okay, so we found the Christmas section. <laughs> He's always doing something else. Never focus. Never. You don't even talk to nobody, you know? This Christmas is seven foot tall, seven and a half feet tall, $89. It's like a good green color, like a real green color. Um, so this is, this is a nice one. I like this one a lot. It's pretty big though, so come over here. which is <laughs> um, $69, and it is seven foot tall, so it takes, up, it takes up that inch, and it's a lot skinnier. The color is a little ashy, um, it's a little ashy green, you know? But I asked on Instagram whether I should get one or two. So we're gonna see what they say, and then we gonna get it. All the other ones are beautiful too, but let me show you guys this one. wait for people to vote on what they want my tree to be 
we're gonna go ahead and look and see if we can get some other things. But ooh, ooh, I love that. I love that right there. I think if I get a refund, I'll put it on the inside of my door. I'm not gonna put it on the outside. <laughs> I don't want nobody taking it. $25.47, that's a good price. She, shrugger, I should ask them. I should ask, oh, I should ask Instagram for everything. Which reef should I get? That's what I'm gonna do. It's been about mm, 20 minutes. So I'm gonna check to see what people chose, one or two. And at first people were choosing one because one is cuter, but two is cheaper. So I think, let's look now, <gasps> it's close. Five votes for one and eight votes for two. Dang, I almost wanna override them and still get this one. <laughs> I think I'm gonna override that vote and get this one still. I think I can. <laughs> he said, you asked her for polls and not been obliging. That's true. But if I, it wasn't a long time, you know, I didn't give them a long periodically time to check. It's been 27 minutes. Hmm. All right, this one is, the number on this one is T23. 23? Yeah, T23. I'm gonna override. I'm gonna override, I'm gonna get this big one. I'm just gonna override this one. They don't know, they can't see it in person. They don't know. They don't know. Okay, so. <laughs> I wanna use it for years after, you know? This one is one that you could use over and over again. You could redecorate it differently and stuff like that. The other one is kind of skinny. What if I get a big apartment? Fuck it, leave it. I'm gonna do what my baby daddies want. I'm gonna do what they want. <laughs> you sure? Yeah, so I'm gonna follow the rules. Yeah. I'm gonna look again in like 10 minutes yeah. though. I'm gonna check again before we leave. If it changes, I'm coming back. So for the Christmas tree, the votes have turned around and Chris said that he's gonna go on there and vote for number one so he can just get number one. What if someone else voted for two and it's 12-12? <laughs> All right, so Instagram decided that we get this wreath. These light bulbies, or these bulbies for the tree and T25, $89. For the tree. So yeah, now we're gonna go to the 99 cent store. We at the 99 cent store, y'all. And you know, they real trifling for charging you to get a damn shopping cart. <laughs> they like, give me your money first. You can get it back when you return our cart. This is the first time I ever saw a cart just, I'm gonna return both of them. Hey, push this one so I can steal this person's corner. Or go return it and take the quarter out. <laughs> okay, just watch my purse, you looking lost. <laughs> Broke a fines, y'all. I got a quarter. We got a good amount of stuff. <gasps> they got some ballies over here. Oh, these are looking expensive though. No, they're good. They're a good price. I got a good shopping cart full of little decor pieces that will help me put my living room together. They got more stuff over here that I didn't see. Oh, look at these little pillows. Oh, suction sealed. Oh, they even got a Christmas tree for 30 bucks. They got some good stuff over here, like little gifts and stuff. Oh, I wanted to get candy canes, that's for sure. What the heck? Now later cherry, Ugh. come to mama. Actually, I don't really like cherry. Now later, yeah, I do. Do they got regular ones though? I need some regular ones. Scared. Follow cat. No well, no well, no well, no well. So I spent damn near four hundred dollars. My budget was five hundred dollars to um, do the Christmas decor, but um, I spent less than that because I spent two fifty at Walmart and seventy six at. 99 cent store. I didn't buy anything at Big Lots. So I was underneath my budget. 
now I'm about to go home and decorate. I'm gonna show you guys the before and after. My apartment's a fucking mess right now. So I think I'm gonna clean it first and then start to decorate. That should be fun. I don't know if I wanna decorate my bedroom or any of the bedrooms. I think I wanna just decorate the dining room, the kitchen, and the living room and call it a fucking day. So we're home and now it's time to decorate. I wanted to show you guys what the apartment looks like now um, first and then show you the things I got and then show you guys what it looks like after. This is what the apartment is looking like now. As you can see, I got the bags right over there on the floor. My couch just looks like that. That's the Christmas tree in the brown box. We got the reef on the couch. We got one pillow on the couch already. Here's some more bags and here are the rest of the bags. So I'm not, <sighs> I'm not decorating, only rooms I'm gonna be decorating today are the living room and the dining area, which is here and there. I don't even plan on really touching the kitchen. I might get in there, you know what I'm saying, depending on how many decorations I have left. But these are the only two places that I'm really gonna be decorating. I'm not gonna get into the rooms at all, I don't think. Maybe a little bit in the bathroom as well, but other than that, and only the guest bathroom. This is the dining room. And this is the living room. Okay, I need to figure out where I'm gonna put the tree. That's number one. But this is what I'm thinking. I'm thinking the tree will be good in the corner right there and then I move the dining table and make the dining table the long way. But I'll show you, I'll take you guys, I'll pick you guys up along the way. But as for now, I don't know. So this was at the 99 cent store, you all. They was $5.99. Yeah. And it say, no well. I got some little decorations, like little, you know, little gold decorations. I think that's what I'm gonna go for. So these were all 99 cents. Flowers, these were also from the 99 cent store. Which, they were cuter than the ones from Walmart. The ones from Walmart were 98 cents. But these ones was from the dollar store. And they cute. You know those little flake, those little flake flowers? Those little fake flowers, cause I got like little fake flower vases around my house. So you know what I'm gonna do? Oh, these need to be cut. The Christmas tree that y'all picked was $89, which I feel like is a steal. <laughs> Who gonna come help me put these lights up though? Cause I can't do everything. I can't do everything. You don't never help. You don't never help up around the house and you just be expecting me to do everything. Tired of having all these lazy ass baby daddies, you know? First, I'm gonna show you guys these little cute little ornaments that I got. Look at this, it was a dollar, so all these ornaments in here were a dollar from the 99 cent store. A cute little star ornament, this cute, and it's like heavy, you know? You know how Africans measure value. It's heavy. <laughs> what does that mean, it's supposed to be expensive? But yeah, I got two of those. And this one came with two on it. It looked like earrings. It's cute, right? A dollar. Y'all can't tell nobody, but I did some hood ass shit with this one. So this one, they're attached, right? By like the plastic. So I was like, I ain't gonna pay for both of those. So yeah, I ended up just acting like I didn't know that they were separate. And then they charged me <laughs> for one. Cause I'm a hood rat, so. The next thing I got are these red, like, North Stars. I got some little acorns. Oh, those are so cute. They got little sparkles on it. Some jingle bells, these jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle bells, rock. I got these lights, these are like the rain, the like iceberg ones, the ones that like came from the ceiling. I don't even know if I'm gonna use these. Like, I don't know if I wanna use these cause I wanted to put lights around like the ceiling. But I don't know if I should use these ones or if I should use these ones. They're just, they don't hang, you know? So y'all tell me which ones I should use. Should I use these ones to decorate around the um, ceiling or should I get like little iceberg ones? And then I got these green ones for the tree. So you can't see that it's, um, they're light, you know? So yeah. These were like $18 each, I wanna say. Either 18 or 24, so. Got 
It's just like little things you can put like gifts in. Kind of like stockings for the modern day. You know, you don't have to put the stockings up on the wall. You just kind of put these out and then fill it with little cute things. So I got each size in two different colors, the gold and the red. Cause that's what my theme was supposed to be until y'all picked, oh there's something in here. Until you guys picked um, those silver lights, those silver silver bulbs for my um, Christmas tree. <sighs> Anyways, what y'all gonna be doing for Christmas? Where y'all gonna be going? You're going home for Christmas? I don't know what's worth for the earth. Is it the Christmas tree? Or is it the plastic that they used to make these fake trees? Like, is it worse to cut down the tree or is it worse to, you know, use this plastic shit? Cause plastic is bad for us too. I think this is better because you could reuse it. You know, you cut it down a tree for Christmas. <clears throat> that tree's gonna take two, like at least 20 years to grow back. That's a long time. Just cutting those poor trees out off the uh, plantation. Fucked up man. We ain't gonna have no more oxygen to breathe and then y'all gonna be like, man, we shouldn't have been cutting them Christmas trees down. <laughs> Is it starting to look full? I'm gonna show you guys the difference between where I have fluffed and where I have not fluffed yet. So, this is what it looks like when you fluff it and you pull the leaves apart. And this is what it looks like when you don't. You can literally see through the tree. So as you can see, I've fluffed this side of the Christmas tree, but I have not fluffed this side yet. So you can see the difference, how it looks like fluffy over there and over there, it's really scanty. So make sure you fluff your Christmas trees. How you literally just pull the leaves apart like that. <laughs> Filthy animal and a happy new year. Okay, so I'm done for tonight. Um, obstacles I ran into the bulbs don't come with the hangers, so I don't have any hangers, so I haven't put those bulbs up. I didn't know where to hang the wreath, so it's just on the door right here for now. I think I'm gonna put it here, but 
I've never seen anybody hang something on this door. I don't know what kind of, it sounds like hollow, so I don't know how that works. And then, um, the centerpiece looks great. I actually love it, but the contrast of this painting is throwing me the hell off. So, I don't know if I should take this painting down and put the reef right there, but we'll figure it out. And then, obviously, the couch. So, I think the couch kind of ties in the picture, because that's how it's supposed to be, but with the red and gold decorations it's kind of eh. so yeah 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 i put the poinsettias inside the vase i have my red velvet throw and i put the noel pillows out and then i also put some garland on my little palm tree uh, and it has some little pine nuts as well so or pine cones so yeah and then i put these two cones of little fluffy things where my candles were so now it's like festive, I like that. And then everything else is just junk and it will be cleaned up later because I'm freaking tired. So good night, we'll continue tomorrow. Bye.